And tonight we're getting a look at the tense moments when gunfire broke out at a youth football game in Fort Bend County over the weekend. A couple is in jail now in connection with it. Reporter Micah Hatfield joins us live with the video. Micah. The emotions are high in this case because there were children out here on the field when it happened. Witnesses that I spoke to tell me that they're upset with how the league handled the situation that day because they said it didn't need to get to this point. You can hear the pops of gunfire from Saturday's youth football game in Richmond at Harlem Field. An ABC 13 viewer who witnessed what happened shared these videos that are circulating online. You can hear the screams and fear in people's voices. Their seven and eight year olds had just been facing off at a football game when witnesses tell us parents and volunteers took it too far. This video also sent to ABC 13 shows a ref knocked to the ground in a several minute long scuffle that broke out on the field prior to the gunfire. Ultimately, the Fort Bend County Sheriff's Office arrested Brittany Flowers and Calvin Flowers for their role in what happened. She was charged with aggravated assault with a deadly weapon for firing the gun. He allegedly assaulted a 13 year old girl in the midst of the chaos. Witnesses telling ABC 13 off camera that there's far more to this story and many believe the flowers acted in self defense, but those people would not come forward to share those details on camera. The Fort Bend Youth Football League confirming to ABC 13 that they will not allow those associated with the league, including parents, to speak to the media. They told us it's because they don't have all the facts yet, but said they are putting additional safety measures in place as necessary to ensure the well-being of their league. Both flowers are still in jail tonight. In Fort Bend County, Micah Hatfield, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.